What's up guys? So I'm here with my updated eyebrow tutorial. My eyebrows are like a full quarantine right now, which I'm actually excited about because now I can actually finally do the video. This is just how I've been maintaining my eyebrows. We all know if you razor them or do anything besides waxing or threading, your eyebrows typically will grow back in about two weeks. Um, Yeah, my hair grows pretty fast. So as you can see, I did this routine about two and a half weeks ago. And I'm already looking like a bomb. Before we start, I want to show you this little kit right here. I got this actually from my mom on Mother's Day last year. She loves this kit. So this basically comes with everything you need. I got it on sale at Ulta Beauty, like, like I said, last year. So this would be a good, good starter kit for you guys who are learning how to do eyebrows. I'll put the info below, but it comes with everything. But pretty much in the kit, it comes with your little spoolie, your tweezers, your razor, your scissors. And this is also a different type of blade you could use for your eyebrows. So this kit is really, oops. This kit is super helpful if you are a beginner because you get everything in one little kit. It's a good kit to have if you are a beginner because it comes with everything. So pretty much I never had an issue with my eyebrows this whole quarantine because I had this kit. So y'all know or some of y'all don't know I am a huge idiot when it comes to asking on TV stuff. So I went ahead and purchased the Flawless Brow Razor thing. Y'all seen it on TV with the light. Yeah, I'm one of those people. I mean, it's all right. It'll do the job, but we on lockdown, so honey, we're not finna complain right now. You wanna always start with a clean face. I'm gonna take some alcohol, and we're gonna take a cotton ball and just go over our eyebrows area just to make sure everything's nice and clean and prep for this process. I'm not sure if my eyebrow hairs are just thick or what, but you have to apply pretty much a lot of pressure on the tool for it to actually clean up the way that you would like it to clean up. So what I do is I just put a little pressure on it and I also go against the way my hair is growing and also go back and forth in some circular motions. Just do whatever you have to do to get the hair to be removed because unlike the TV commercial, you do have to put some pressure on it while using this tool for it to work properly. It's not going to give you the exact clean look that you would get from a wax, but it does clean up your area for the most part. So make you join me in my Bugatti Join me in my Bugatti Only you in my Bugatti Only you in my Bugatti To my Jeep Seagull Something to myself She wants a wider my place She looking at my eye order She wants a wider She be moving so quick You never see her coming She wants a wider She and me She's like the baddest girl me I ever ever seen. Something like a queen. She your number one lover, hot and cold. You be begging her, please, no. If you tell me I'm so I'm just taking my spoolie just to check out the hairs a little bit and as you can see it did clean us up really good This is the other eyebrow So this is the before look and then you can see the after look using the flawless brow So it really did clean us up. So I'm gonna do the same thing for this eyebrow Wonder. Mm -hmm. She wants a wonder. Mm -hmm. She wants a wonder. Mm -hmm. Batman. 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 Na, na, na. 
So that's a result using the flawless brow. What you guys think? I think it did pretty good. So we're going to go into this alcohol again and get rid of the dead hair and everything that we just razored off with our cotton ball and alcohol. We're going to go into that Kiss New York kit and we're going to take out this razor. This is the shorter angled razor in the kit. And we're just going to use it to clean up our area and just make everything look more polished than it did with the flawless brow. So it may look like I'm applying a lot of pressure but I'm really not. I'm just gently going against the natural arch of my eyebrow to clean it up a little bit more to prep our eyebrows for the filling process. She wants to see Wanda, want get high grade. From a distance, baby, I'm going insane. Red Cross, baby, come to my aid. Shorty said he busted my brain like a migraine. Your game, my game, your loss, my pain. Slope down, the way you go down. You know now, now me they run the whole town. King of the city, cause I wear that gold crown. So give it up for bad man, better than Batman. I didn't impress these dogs and kill this cats, man. Rats, man, these other guys are rats, man. When I get on stage, all they do is clap, man. So make you join me in my Bugatti Join me in my Bugatti Only you in my Bugatti Only you in my Bugatti She my Jeep Seeger Be something to myself She wants a wider Give me money in my place She looking at my eye harder She wants a wider She be moving so quick uh -huh. You never see her coming She wants a wider She had me ever yeah. She's like the baddest girl me I ever, ever seen Something like a queen She your number one lover Her time cold, you be begging her please No, if you tell me I own I'll take you on, then I'll put you on Girl, girl so for this tutorial, I'm using two different eyebrow pencils. The first one we're going to use is the Max Stud Pencil for $19 at the Max Store. This is a popular go-to for a lot of people for a lot of years, so that's why I chose it. Then we're going to go on the other eyebrow using the cheaper version, which is Top Brow by Kiss New York that runs about $6.99 to $9 in the hair store. So I like to start off by starting at the bottom of my eyebrow. I'm basically just drawing a line and also filling it in at the same time. It's hard to explain but hopefully you can look at the video and see what I'm actually doing. So I start with my line and I just draw it straight across following the natural lining of my eyebrow. Then when I go on the top of my eyebrow, I like to start in the middle. I don't start in the beginning because I feel like it creates a harsh line and it's hard to blend out later on down the line. So I just start in the middle and just follow the top area of my eyebrow. And then I slightly will fill in towards the inner part of my eyebrow. It'll make more sense throughout the video. So this is the reason why I don't start in the beginning of my eyebrow because as you can see we're going to gradually just fill in the top and the bottom because we're going to take our spoolie and blend it out. This is going to give us the most natural look, this is going to give us that ombre effect that we're looking for and it's not going to leave any harsh line in the beginning of your eyebrow that some people really struggle with. So this is my tip of how to avoid that problem. Next we're going to take our concealer of choice. I'm using LA Girls Pro Concealer in the color Fawn because I love the way it blends out with my skin tone. And we're going to take our MAC 212 brush. You can use any type of flat or angle brush that you have at home. This is my personal favorite so that's why I always use it. We're going to get that concealer on our brush and we're going to start at the bottom of our eyebrow. Again, keep it simple ladies. Let's go ahead and just 
line everything up the same thing we did from the beginning of the video we're just gonna line it up so everything you did in the beginning as far as following the bottom of your eyebrow line you're gonna do that with your concealer as well go ahead and just follow that line and just make it clean this will take some time to get used to so don't freak out if you mess up the first couple times I've just been doing my eyebrows for years like this so I can pretty much do it with my eyes closed at this point so don't beat yourself up if you make a mistake if you go too far up if you go too far down don't worry it all takes time to practice but I'm telling you if you keep it simple and keep the same technique as following that eyebrow pattern of your line you can do it I promise you Fall from my sky, panties are dropping, showing the towel. She's a, she's a professional. I think, I think I'm lost in the love life. We came strong together. She got a strong desire. Up to the morning after. So we're gonna blend all this concealer out with my Morphe brush. This brush coat is M173. This is mostly just a concealer brush, but it's super dense. And I love the way it blends out. This is like one of my favorite concealer brushes to work with because it just blends out everything so easily compared to other brushes. So just go ahead and just blend all the concealer out until you have no harsh lines. So ladies, that's the result for using the Top Brow by Kiss New York. Now we're going to go into our MAC Stud Pencil and we're going to use this on the other eyebrow. Young buds, buds, baby. I see Big uh, From a distance, baby, I'm going insane. Red cross, baby, come to my aid. Shorty said he busted my brain like a migraine. Your game, my game, your loss, my pain. Slow down, the way you go down. You know now, now me they run the whole town. King of the city, cause I wear that gold crown. So give it up for bad man, better than Batman. I didn't impress these dogs and kill these cats, man. Rats, man, these other guys are rats, man. When I get on stage, all they do is clap, man. So make you join me in my Bugatti. Join me in my Bugatti. Only you in my Bugatti. Only you in my Bugatti. See my Jeep Seeger. Something to myself. She wants to wire. She be money in my place, she looking at my eye harder She wants to wander, she be moving so quick uh -huh. You never see her coming She wants to wander, she uh -huh. and me yeah. That's what yeah. we say She's like the baddest girl me I ever, ever seen Something like a queen She your number one lover, her tank oh, You be begging her please, no If you tell me on I'll take you on, then I'll put you on, girl, girl Feel me now, the thing that you want, thing I got to you, own, girl, girl See me falling, fall from my sky Panties are dropping, throwing the towel She's a, she's a professional I think, I think I'm lost in the love life We came strong together She got a strong desire Up to the morning after Now she's moving on Alright you guys, so this is the final result of how I maintain my eyebrows, no salon needed. 
perfect for beginners and the reason why like I said I use two different eyebrow pencils just to show you guys low quality versus high end so I use a cheap hair store eyebrow pencil for this eye well for this eyebrow and then I use the popular Mac eyebrow pencil on this side so you be the judge cheap expensive so the trick I've been using for years is putting got to be gel to set my eyebrows. So back in the day, I think it was called, I don't know what it was called, but it was this clear bottle off Amazon. It was an eyebrow filler everybody went crazy about. I went crazy for it as well until I found out I was wasting money because I could use my gel at home. What I do is take the gel. Put it on the end of one of those spoolies, brushes you have. Not too much. And we're just going to apply it on the same direction of our eyebrow hair. This doesn't leave it crispy, it doesn't leave it shiny. It literally is the best eyebrow sealer ever. And I've been doing this for years, I wanna say about about six years now, I've been using my gel to set my eyebrows. I personally like when the front of my hair is a little wild looking because it looks natural to me. So you don't have to do this. I just personally like when it's a little bit out of place because to me it just looks more natural that way. I know some people actually just do their eyebrows without their actual makeup. You can take you a kind of a brush like this. This is just a NYX brush. I don't know what kind of brush this is. It's just one of those brushes that I actually love using. And I don't even know what it's called, but it's from NYX. Take whatever powder that you're using. I'm going to use the Infallible by L'Oreal. And we're just going to take our brush and we're just going to set in this eyebrow area. Just in case you plan on just doing powder for this day or not really doing your makeup at all. It will also allow the concealer to actually stay in place when you actually set it around your eyebrows. Because like I said, I know there's a lot of people who just do their eyebrows but they don't wear makeup. And then they're like, well my eyebrows are like bleeding out. Like some hair color <laughs> because um, they didn't set it. They also did not set it their concealer around your eyebrow so you sweating throughout the day and your concealer is sweating into your eyebrow work and it's just making it look all smushed up so this is just what i do for my eyebrows when i don't feel like doing a full face of makeup but just want to look decent i will set around my eye area as well as my actual eyebrows so this is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. People used to pick on my eyebrows because they talk about they look like upside down Nike checks. But you can see like my eyebrow shape is kind of like this. So I hope this tutorial helped you guys out there. I still do the same routine for the most part. I don't really switch up my um, routine when it comes to my face. But I really, 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 really hope y'all learned something. Thank you so much for all the love and support. I can't believe my little raggedy videos are really helping y'all still after all these years. So I really, really appreciate it and y'all really keep me going. Na 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 Kike Young Buds Buds baby I see uh,